Hi everyone, this is Kamel. Welcome back to Video Pro Guide Tutorial. In this series, we will walk you through how to create stunning video with Video Pro Flagger. But before we dive into the journey, make sure you check out the link in the description box down below to download the software for free. Alright, so now let's get the video started. You probably seen this interesting echo motion trail effect. It's widely used in vlogs. Creating the motion trail effect in a regular and perhaps the old school way needs us to work with a pro level selection and masking tools, which is difficult for beginners to master. In this video, I'm gonna show you a much easier way. Use the darken blending mode in Video Product Flagger to create this awesome looking motion trail effect in minutes. Let's start this tutorial by figuring out how the darken blending mode works. Simply put, it chooses the darker colors of two overlap layers. It keeps whichever one of the two is the darker as a blend color. Pixels lighter than a blend color are replaced, and the pixels darker than that are kept. Let's use this grayscale image as an example. Firstly, add this picture to the video track. Then import a 50% gray layer, add it to the overlay track. Then change the blending mode to darken. Move it around. You'll notice when it's placed at the left part of the background image, which looks lighter, the gray color is retained. And when we overlay this gray picture to the darker right section, we can only see the background image. After getting the basics, of the dark and blending mode. Let's get into the how-to tutorial. Open up Video Product Flagger. Import the video. Give a notice here. Motion trail effect works best with a still shot. And more ideally, there is a noticeable contrast between the main and the background. Here, we use this black and white skateboard video as an example. Move the playhead forward to reach the proper position, for example here. Then press Shift and M, or click on there to add a marker. Find the camera button on the top right corner. This can capture the current frame as a picture and save it on your local folder. Drag the picture onto Video Product Flagger. Then we drag the progress bar forward. When reaching the next movement, we repeat the last steps to get a series of freeze frames from the video. We then need to add as many new overlay tracks as the freeze frames. And add them to the overlay track in order from top to bottom. Use these two buttons to scale the images to their proper display size. Then based on the markers we just added, drag the ends of these images to make them appear from the time indicated by the markers until the end of the source video. Now let's choose the darken as the new blending mode. Let's preview the outcome. Mm, nicely done. Alright, now you've reached the end of today's video about how to create a motion trio effect with a darken blending mode in Video Product Flagger. I think you've got it. 
Don't forget to click the subscribe button to subscribe if you haven't yet. We will see you in our next tips. Hope you enjoy. Bye.